In this video, we're going to show you how to replace the upstream O2 sensor on your G35 Infinity. Remove the two 10 millimeter nuts for the engine cover. This vehicle only has one. Also remove the two 10 millimeter bolts. There should be one right here. Then remove the cover. Remove the MAF sensor connector. You should have an air box in this area. The guy before us put a pod filter on. So all we have is this one 10 millimeter bolt. I'm gonna remove that. Using an eight millimeter, loosen the clamp. Using a 10 millimeter socket, remove the bolt for the bracket. I lift the pipe up and just kind of put it back. And this is the harness we're going to be going after. We're going to undo this connector. It's a bulkhead style, so we're just going to pull back. And then remove it. Using a long trim removal tool, remove the plastic holder on top. Using a 22 millimeter, remove the O2 sensor. Once you have this loose, you'll be able to remove it by hand. Remove the O2 sensor. Install the new O2 sensor. Snug the sensor down. Torque it to 37 foot pounds. If you can't get a torque wrench in there, do the best you can. I'm gonna use a long trim tool to help me install this plastic clip right into there. We're gonna connect our harness, reach down and grab it. Plug it in and then close the little door. Make sure it clicks into place. Install the intake back into place. Snug down the clamp. Install the bolt for the bracket. And then the bolt for the air box bracket. Install your MAF connector. Install the engine cover. Snug down all of your bolts and your two nuts. You're good to go. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.